of the trial courts. Several of you may have already gotten summons from me. I wanted to do a little introductory video today just to let you know what to expect as a part of the jury process. So, if you'll follow along, you'll see that we have a check-in station. You'll come along, you'll get your temperature taken, you'll answer a few questions about uh, COVID and possible exposures, and then you'll be given a pass to go inside the courthouse. After you meet with the COVID screeners and your pass to come inside the courthouse, you'll go up the stairs or around the ramp and inside and through our security. Come on. Once inside the courthouse, you'll be required to wear a mask, and then you enter in through the security here and you'll be screened for any possible weapons or other safety devices. Once inside the historic courthouse, once you've been screened by security, you'll enter the rotunda area. That's where we are right now. You'll go down the hall and up the stairs or the elevator to the second floor, and that's where our courtroom is. Once you reach the top of the stairs, you'll see the superior court courtroom behind me. You'll come to the top of the stairs and do what's called jury check-in. Either myself or a jury clerk will help check you in. We'll verify your address and get a daytime phone number for you. We'll also give you an opportunity to pick up any protective gear that you prefer. We've got hand sanitizer, gloves, masks, uh, face shields, and whatever makes you feel comfortable is what we want you to use. After jury check-in, you'll be escorted to your seat by one of our bailiffs. Once inside the historic courtroom, you may be asked to have a seat on the main floor or you may be asked to have a seat in the balcony. All of our seats are marked for social distancing as well as marked for jury seating. You can see how the courtroom is set up for social distancing as well. The attorney tables are turned towards the audience. The audience is going to be the jury box as well as the jury deliberation room. We have dividers to protect attorneys and clients for social distancing purposes when they can't sit far apart. And we have the court reporter moved as well. During COVID, our courtroom is used as both the jury box and the jury deliberation room. The seats are brightly marked 1 through 12, as well as 13 and 14 for alternate jurors. You can see that they're socially distanced and spaced apart in the courtroom for ample viewing. The judge will come in and tell the court more about what's going on in terms of our jury safe jury resumption plan. Our jury resumption plan has been approved by the Chief Justice of the North Carolina Supreme Court as a safe way to conduct jury operations in Alamance County. We look forward to having you. We hope you feel safe during your process. Please call the clerk's office with any questions and we're happy to address them with you. See you soon.